You are now in the court of O'Neill, King of Ireland. Hey guys, and welcome back to Crusader Kings 2. I am Sifa Cat, and today we're going to take over this little area of Scotland, the final part of the Breton Band, because they're there, and frankly we've had enough of their shit existing. So we're going to go and deal with that, after which we're going to see if we can deal with this little bit of England that remains. There's not much England remaining, but we still need to deal with it at some point in the near future, and hopefully that near future will be this episode. That's the big plan. But of course, you know, every time I've made this plan, hey guys, let's get Britannia this episode, something has gone horribly, horribly wrong, and frankly, I don't think it's happening anymore. Because it's just never happening, it seems. That's alright, we'll get it this time. I know we will. Uh, vassal levies to... That's not even a problem, why would you bring that up to me? Do I care that my vassals don't like me? Okay, so we've got a 16 to 1 advantage, I'm just going to assault this. The men will come back by the time I need them, and frankly, no army comes close to actually being a threat to me. So we're just going to win this war as quickly as possible, just to get out of the way. Great. And finally, wow, really that... Oh, I was going to say, that bishopric is really built up, but then I realized we're actually after a town, which... Towns usually have a lot of soldiers in them. That's pretty normal. But... Oh, actually, we're going to lose a lot of men in this one. Oh well. Whatever. We've lost 5,000 men doing this when we could have lost, like, 30. Holy shit, we've lost 10,000 men assaulting this place. We might even lose. In fact, we're gonna lose. That was rather foolish. Okay. Uh, that's not what I expected to happen. Alright, now we need to go get more men. Sigh, because you guys can't even manage a siege properly. Maybe we could just win it right here. No, he's, this is his last territory. He's not going to let me win this here. Okay, so that was a little bit overambitious. I think we can all agree on that. But that's okay. Sometimes ambition is needs to be over. <laughs> Nothing wrong with a bit of overambition, right? Right. I mean, you know... 14,000 men were killed because of that mistake, but, you know, 14,000 men? Really? Drop in the pan, really, isn't it? No one really cares. Uh, typhus is broken out in Dublin. That's disappointing, but manageable. You know what, these guys can go just straight to here. You guys can go and fight this 6,000 men. In fact, they're going to run to Fife. You're going to chase them. In fact, we're going to chase these guys all around. Uh, this way... There we go. You eventually catch up to them if you're chasing them. That's the plan I usually have. At some point, when they're running, you will catch up to them. And we did! So that's the most important thing. Uh, 98%. And we're going to beat them up, and then that will be 100%, and then that will be the win. In fact, that's the win right there. Brilliant. Okay, so now we have all of Alba, also known as Scotland. But we don't call it Scotland because we're Irish, and I'm not quite sure why that... Oh! Oh, this is it. This is my chance. If I can... I can't declare war. I need Causus Belly. Okay, let's get Causus Belly! Uh, who's got Causus Belly? None of you guys. Alright, then we're going to have to go to the individual regions. You! My good sir, have Gauza's belly. What about you? Do you have anyone on your land that has Gauza's belly? Do you? Maybe? No, there's actually no one else there. Okay, it's fine. So we'll wait for that guy to join us. Here he is. Great. Then hopefully, if I've done this right, I should. Is there anyone else in this war? I think there's a lot of people in this war, just no one else around here. They're all just fighting around here, which I don't really care about. All I want is this bit here. I will claim Suffolk. This is it, guys. This is it. This is what we've been waiting for. All we've got to do is win this war. Uh, all we've got to do is find enough men to win this war. That's actually easily enough men. We're also inadvertently at war with England. Well, not at war with England, sorry, that's incorrect. We are have hostilities towards England. Which, to be honest, when did we not have hostilities towards England? 
Anyway, everyone march to Essex. If you find any Englishmen on your way, kill them. Whatever makes you happy, really. So, once I get this land, that should give me enough to get the title of Emperor... No, of King. I won't be Emperor just yet, but that'll lead to that. Very quickly it'll lead to that, in fact. Okay, so these guys have accidentally walked into English, and they're getting their asses handed to them. That's fine. In fact, these guys can just march in now. Whatever. You, you, you guys can just go there. It's fine. <laughs> the guys are go attacking England with no morale, because they don't really care. They're just like, ah, attack England! And the English are like, why are you doing this to us? And we're like, we don't even know! We have no idea what we're doing. Uh, Lord Poop School, you can lead the siege. Because you're the best sold You're the best military mind the Irish army has ever seen, Lord Poopsicle! Of course, that was a very British voice, but you know what? Lord Poopsicle doesn't mind. He's a pretty chillax guy. Uh, now we need someone to lead that siege. Uh, this guy. This Arab guy that I got out of nowhere. Alright, and so now we just wait for these sieges to finish their dark, dark work. And then uh, we have England. Of course, our main title will still be Ireland. What are they doing? Uh, they're wanting to arrange marriage. Who are you wanting to marry? A courtier that has only a claim to Vesterland? Uh, yeah, sure. I'll take 315 gold. I mean, it's not like she means much to me. For some reason, she's being tutored by Lord Poopsicle. I don't know quite why that's happening, but whatever. Does not bother me too much. Also, I've got this land. Oh, they're rebelling because of reasons. That's fine. Okay, so before I take this treaty, the first thing I have to remember to do is make sure that I am not... I have given land to this person. I'm not going to give them land until we've won. There's no reason to give them land just yet, so we're just going to take it calm. Yeah, you know, we're going to give them some, probably the land that I just got from the Breton Band. That's probably the best idea. And, yeah, all is going well. I mean, no one's really going to contest this. Okay, you're so in distrust, that's cool. I don't think it even matters anymore. Uh, and I have become possessed! Yes, I speak in tongues! This is a not a good thing. This, this is actually quite a bad thing. Um, so I've gone crazy. Uh, let's see. One of my courtiers are not happy. Uh, and I imprisoned him. <laughs> and someone just likes me more for imprisoning him. Okay! I didn't really have much of a say in that one, but... You're welcome! <laughs> Uh, is there any plots that I can have? I can kill a lot of people if I want. Uh, actually, that's not a bad idea. Let's see who we should kill. I mean, I know I was doing stuff, but... Oh, a Duke of the Isles. He is not of our lineage. He's a good choice for killing. No, he's not. I have enough people who are with me on that one. I shouldn't probably pause while doing this. I should probably just keep going, because otherwise things are going to take forever. Uh, any more dukes? No. Oh, actually, yes. Oh, that's a revoke. Revokes are no good. Actually, revokes are more useful than kills, because at least that way... Uh... Yeah, I'll revoke your territory. It's fine. I guess it's not. No one really is okay with this. Oh well, whatever. I was just trying to see if I get more free land for my dynasty. Um, but I guess we're about to do that anyway, aren't we? We're about to get the Kingdom of England! Which is something that I thought would take a... Well, actually I thought it would be something that would happen faster, but, you know, one thing led to another and then it wasn't as easy as I thought it would be. But that's okay. So, the war continues and we're at 10%, which is a good number to be at. Let's see if we can find a plot that's actually slightly better. Uh, Gowie, where's Gowie? No, that's what I already tried to do. Uh, 
What about her? No, there's just not really any high plot power numbers of people agree with, agreeing with me. So, maybe I'll just be patient. Patience is not something I like doing, but perhaps it's the best idea at this point. At this juncture. So as long as this war doesn't end too quickly, which I do not think it is. No, they're at 4%. Well, you're fighting for your claim on England. Well, I've got a funny story for you. You're not going to worry about that claim on England very soon, because I would... No, the crown of England will be at war, so until that war is over, I won't be able to do anything anyway. That's a little bit annoying, but that's okay. Uh, we're dragging people off to the dungeons. Good. My voice went a little bit weird. That's fine. Because people are dying in dungeons every day. Like, I don't care about any of these deaths. I mean, yeah, people die. Big whoop de doo If I don't kill them, I don't care. And if I kill them, I know it was me. So, I wonder if there's actually anyone I can sell back to people. Yeah, no one I really care about is a Baron, I suppose. I mean, maybe I could sell a Baron back. How much will you give me for a Baron? 25 gold? I'll give you, I'll take the 25 gold. I don't really care anymore. I mean, 25 gold is nothing. I mean, I get, like... Oh. Okay. Excellent. So, before we click accept, we're going to go to this guy, and we're going to grant him a landed title of the County of... Caithness. Now, you're a landed lord, and I will accept your terms of surrender. Now... I get, have more land. With this more land, can I England this up now? I cannot because it's currently the, de uh, the justification for an ongoing war. Hmm. Okay. That's fine. Can I offer to join your war? Just to make this faster. I don't particularly care about your war, England. I just want this to be done with. He's like, wow, it's so nice of you help, to help me out, Ireland. You know, you've kicked my ass so many times. And now you just help me out. Now we're brothers. Please, take my sister. And I'm like, I will take your sister, sir. Okay, so they've accepted that. Those fools. That'll be their first mistake of the day. The second mistake will be the part where they accepted my help. The third mistake is the same mistake. They just keep making that same mistake. It's really just one mistake they've made, and they're just and that's going to ruin them. Which is the exact sort of mistake I like people to make. Mistakes that ruin them. But they make me awesome, so... Where are all my men? I thought I had more men than this. Oh well. I don't. Clearly. But anyway, England will win this war. Uh, because, I mean, the forces of Ireland are behind them. So how could they lose? It's pretty much a general rule, you know? Oh, the forces of Irish are here. Well, I guess we've just bloody won, haven't we? That's what the English will say. By the Queen! The, <laughs> the Irish forces are here! Alright, so... The goal here is just to win this war so that we can not worry about it ever again. So we're going to split this force up into groups of, you know, 6,000 men go that way, 6,000 men stay here, we could probably take another... No, that's fine actually. We'll just do it that way. I don't know why I can't raise the Normandy forces. Oh, now I can. Great. That wasn't even all the Normandy forces, that was just a thousand men. Well, that's no good. I'm gonna need a few more men than that to uh, take over that land. That's enough. Great. Help out. Good job. Uh... You know what? Yeah, sure. I don't mind Essex being... Uh... 
demoted. Alright, so Essex. Who has Essex now? Oh wait, Essex, not Wessex. You do. Okay. Doesn't really bother me either way, honestly. So now we're just fighting. We're just sieging because we can. There's no real reason for this. Uh, but... Yeah. England will be so happy when they realize what I've done. They're like, thank you so much, Ireland. You will forever be in our history books. So it's like, <laughs> yeah, you're not wrong there, buddy. And then I'll be forever in their history books. Uh, let's just put some people in jail, because... Ooh, we can put you in jail? Sure. I'll take that. And uh, the sieges are beginning to work. Great. The first one there was going to be the easiest, because they didn't have any men there in the first place, and this one will fall pretty quick, so we might as well just take it. Uh, 7,000 men there. If they turn around, that could be a problem. What are these French up to? Ah, oh, Barcelona declared independence. And there's a peasant revolt. <laughs> oh, peasant revolts. You are hilarious. So, yeah. Is this actually part of England? I don't even remember. Oh, where did I lose? Oh, was that the 7,000 men? Did they attack when I wasn't looking? They did, didn't they? Those sneaky men... Uh, but they're not interested in chasing after me. I cannot do that. I don't know why you'd think that I could. You know what, let's just disband that. They're not going to do anything of real use anymore. They lost too many men in that fight. So they didn't really want them to fight in the first place. So, England's war is now at 22%. That'll be increasing very soon on our favour. Assuming England doesn't fuck up anything. Which, let's be honest, it is England. And England are, uh, in this game, a mighty fuck-up. But no, they're doing alright. 32%. Hopefully England stops this... <laughs> England, stop this crazy war at once! Don't you know that you're driving your nation apart? It's like, oh, I didn't realise. Oh, my truce with England is expiring soon. <laughs> the English king isn't even English, he's German. Which actually is true for right now. Because Windsor House is actually German. Well, no, not Windsor House, sorry. It's uh, uh, the original name, because Queen Elizabeth II, I believe, changed it. Or maybe it was the... Someone changed it so they didn't look like they were allied with the Germans for World War I and or II. But, yeah, the... Oh. You're attempting to convert me into your heresy. Uh, I demand that you abandon your heresy. Does that work? It does! Brilliant! I'm, I'm pleased. 34%. I'm not actually sure taking these places is really helping much. Uh, oh no it is. Is it? No it's not. Who started this? Barcelona. Alright. I didn't even know Barcelona was involved in this. Uh, I'm going to need to speak to your king. No, I don't. I can just march through your territories. This isn't Victoria. I can march through your territories any time I like. I forgot about that. No, I'm going to let you rot. Uh, okay, England has moved their main force here now, so they're taking stuff over. It's good. Well, I guess I'll take this last bit of land and then wander over. You know, probably take some boats. Some boats are probably a good idea. How many boats? Lots. As many boats as we can get. It's, oh, it's the boat situation. We've done this many times before. We know how the boats work. Just get as many boats as you can. You just sail them off. See, this isn't really doing anything. It is, of course, cutting off the reinforcements to any part of their army that could later help, but aside from that, it's not really doing anything. 
Okay. So the main person of this is Barcelona, Duchy of Barcelona, and they're there. That's not DJ. Okay. So really, we'll just go around here. I'm not letting people out of jail. Stop being so silly. Uh, court chaplain. No, you're ambitious. But you're the da you're a damn good cop, so we'll take you. Okay, so we're just sending these boats around the coast of Spain or Hispania to, uh, you know, hopefully take over Barcelona. They should change their tune relatively quickly. We've left these places smoking and burning, which is, I think, how you should leave most places, you know, as a rule. As a rule of thumb, you should leave all places smoking and burning. They're trying to raise some forces to take them back, but I don't think it's really going to happen. Oh, it's so cute when they think they're going to get their land back. Actually, we can probably... Actually, no, we'll go one more ahead, and then we'll go walk through here into there. We should probably have some leaders as well. Uh, I've got Captain of the Breton Band. That's interesting. So the Breton Band still kind of controls that land, but not really. That's amusing to me. I mean, overall, this war is going to be lost by them. And then I'm going to get England, because I want it. And that's as good a reason as to do it. A re as good a reason for anything to do anything in life, because I want it. And... Come on! Here we go. Uh, okay, we're currently suffering attrition. What are you going to... who are you going to marry? This person, she has no claims. Sure, I have no real... I don't give any dams about her. And we'll just see this quickly, just because we're suffering attrition, and we might as well just lose the men in combat, then starvation. See, this one's working. Uh, now that fort level was 6.5, this one is 3.0. We could do that again. Aha, we're at 84%. Oh, because we hold uh, the leader prisoner. No? We hold someone an important prisoner. And, yeah, 94%, that's pretty much game right there, I believe. Oh, it's the heir of Barcelona that we hold prisoner. Well, yeah, we're definitely not letting that guy out. But we don't want him to, hu we don't want him to hurt himself. That's also important. So that last one was 3.0, and this one... Oh no. What? I don't want to be there. This one is 5.5. .5. Yeah, it's going to be a hard siege. I think I'll just wait that one out. Uh, and I don't think I need these men anymore. Let's disband them so I can at least get the money. Okay. The throne of England has been won. Congratulations, England. You have won your throne. What? Okay, 49%. That's not the number I wanted to see. Uh, you know what, guys? I've actually lost track of time in this episode, so I will see you next episode, where we attack England one more time for the good of all mankind. Oh, did this become part of England again? Oh, I think this area became part of England, finally. I knew that was going to happen. Okay, so how much more land do we need of England? Uh, one will put us up to... I think we only need one more land, again. Uh. Alright guys, well, join me next episode where we actually take England. See you next time, guys.